I'm at, I'm in Spanish Town. Um, and I'm in the mall in Spanish Town. <laughs> I don't really know what it's called. But... Girl, I was just okay. I'm gonna go into this Woolworth and see how I can find a little knickknacks or anything. So it looks Guys, I'm in the store, Woolworths. It's not my first time in here, but a general, like I really do like it. It reminds me of, um, uh-oh. It reminds me of the dollar, the dollar store in America. Like there's so much stuff here and it's very affordable things. Like, I like it. I like it a lot. The look, everything is in here and it's reasonably priced. Even more so than the other reasonable price stores in Jamaica. Phone call it back. Phone call. Alrighty, guys. So I finished the shopping. Um, I only got some hair products, but now I have to go into Kingston real quick. So I'm gonna make my way over there. Now that I know that place is there, I think we'll come more. Now I like seeing a guy it's so hot. My hand is getting tired with these, with these things. <laughs> yeah. I just love people's energy, like positive energy when I'm vlogging. More um, open my drink. I want to go to the gym, but Marco, hurry up, figure out that thing. Because I don't have much time between now and the um, movie night. I'm here, kind of pull up the. I want to cut off the blonde ends. It's like, I know it wasn't the best for me, but <laughs> sis, sis, it was not the best for me. No if ands or buts about it. But anyways, while I'm here, just wanted you guys to like, comment, and subscribe. These are my prescription glasses. If you are new, I'm not doing it just to look cute. Uh, in fact, if you guys have any advice, the um the metal piece, yeah, the metal piece broke off. No, the plastic piece broke off. So the metal, and don't mind how it looks all green. I've tried to clean it. Um, do you guys have any recommendations or do you think I should go to like one of the glasses stores down here, the eye stores down here and ask if they can like assist in fixing? Um, I got these from Lens Crafters but I'm not sure, like I don't know when I'd get to fix them. So dusty. Alright guys, make sure you like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you at movie night. Alright, so it's still movie night vlog but I'm very last minute getting these snacks so it says buy any two liters and get $150 off so we're gonna buy two Pepsi salt and vinegar lays and I know a lot of people don't like that but I do and I told everybody to get their own snacks or at least to buy enough snacks to share with people. So that's what I'm doing.
actually about to pull off soon. I locked my door. <laughs> I just wanted to let you guys know I locked my door. First thing, because there's a steer. So I'm gonna just lock the door as soon as I open it and just lock it right back. Um, but just want to tell you how inside of the bank went. So unfortunately, like four of their machines, if not five, they have a machine off to the side, which I'm not sure if it's hooked up or not. So no, let's call it four because that one didn't have any type of privacy at all. So four of their machines, um, one, two, three, four, yes. So yes, actually let's call it four is working, but they're only taking withdrawals. One isn't working at all and one is only taking deposits so there's literally a line of about 15 20 people at this point and i see more people walking in now so withdrawal people are getting through quick but they still have to form a line so somebody we're all talking and they're talking about how unsafe it is because you know all of us here are lined up this person you know somebody can easily come in and just stand in at the back and pretend that they're in a line watching everybody so this person is withdrawing we know said so the money i'll come up with money we know said so the money i'll come up with money and then we know that these people now are in here all like 20 people are all lined up and just imagine if everybody is depositing let's say about twenty thousand dollars minimum can you imagine like if somebody did run up and rob us that's what they were saying in there that it's very unsafe that like these these banks need to put something in place that when your machine stop working you go out and fix it as soon as possible as soon as possible no tomorrow no later tonight send somebody out no that's very 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 unsafe and we all felt so unsafe like fortunately yeah like you know we're around some from what we are talking about and observing some good minded people that realize that you know guys like we don't feel good so let's just try hurry up as soon as possible and get out of this place um yeah i didn't feel good i did not feel good because i knew i was depositing I'm gonna say because this is coming up days after I know you guys say oh don't share these bank information or whatever I'm not giving you my bank no I'm not giving you my account number or my pin but I'm telling you the experiences that we're all feeling in here like very very unsafe because we're out in the open basically like when all the machines are good you don't know what somebody's doing just people are going up doing the thing and leaving but if we're one lady even took when I went in she was at the deposit and she had took like 15 minutes depositing like other people were standing there at least a good 20 25 minutes from before i came we're just standing there waiting on people to finish it is not it's very unsafe um I, I can't even i don't even know what else to say but the banks need to do better and it's not just one bank it's a lot of these banks and that's what they were saying like they just honestly need to do better need to do better they need to change their system and this would have easily also been avoided too because they have cashless systems now where you can't even go to a teller during the week let's say you did plan to go to a teller you can't even go to a teller and deposit money over the counter and when you do a drop drop box deposit you're not even know like a couple days pass until your money is actually deposited into your account you know so it's just unsafe it's like the system is not working it's very flawed so unless they can come up with something better what they have in place right now is not helping anybody and it's putting people in dangerous positions so that's it <laughs> i'm gonna go get some food and then mega head off to spanish town so yeah where should i get food today i feel like something healthy would have been nice a cook shop want a cook shop up the road and should i go back up there I'm gonna bring you guys to the cook shop that I used to go to. I'm just gonna get some fried chicken and fries. I don't know. that's behind me so if you're coming from uh, what's it Malines Road you're gonna make okay so anyways we're on Bay Farm Road because I'm, I'm trying but it wasn't working out so keep driving as if you're going towards Waltham keep driving like you're driving towards Waltham it's a nice 
stretch of road the restaurant is coming up and it's going to be on your left hand side because i just had to describe it to someone so i was like let me just put it in the vlog all right here is the restaurant this is the water place bomba the restaurant lock but the, what is not this but this is the restaurant that I'll be raving about when I get fried chicken whenever I come and service the car. Wow. Well. <sighs> okay. Okay, okay, all right. Yeah, all right, guys. I guess I'm just gonna figure it out. I'm gonna wing it. <laughs> that was funny. If it was funny, give it a like. If it was not funny, give it a like <laughs> all right guys I'll just see you when I see you all right so I was driving trying to find food and I remembered that I needed to get some screwdrivers for my dresser and I need some um, black spray paint so I book up on this hardware Phil's hardware you guys most likely have seen it before if you've ever driven from Central Village into Spanish Town it's that big hardware on the right so I'll go ahead inside ask for some help and then I see that there's a restaurant right next to it, so I'm going to see if them food is good or not. So let's go in here. Oh, I'm putting up a little fountain. Them cutie. What am I doing? A little, a little cute thing. Anyways, let me go inside. I don't want to record too much people, so. So guys, here's some of the spray paint that I need. No, this is for appliances. Not sure. I'm not sure. Not sure if I'm... They look like spray paint, but they're not. Oh, they are. Some of them are. Caps match the color of the content. So this one is a matte black. I hate when there's no price. I have to find out the price. These are for a vehicle. I didn't know you could spray paint like these things. See, my phone is ringing. Give me a second. So she just told me that she doesn't have, she doesn't have anything like this. But she said maybe like a nut and bolt. So she going to bring it to me. Let me show you what it's looking like. So this is the screw and it's basically what holds my mirror to my dresser and it's been months since I first 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 moved from Portmore um, that it's been lost and I saw one so I'm like let me come and bring it to them and hopefully they can help me so yeah all right guys so these two this is mine and this is what she brought to me they're not that far off. Only thing is mine is a little bit longer. Mine is a little bit longer than the one she brought. So hopefully this one is longer but it's a bit thicker. Alright, so I'm leaving now and unfortunately it didn't work out. I just didn't decide to buy it because what if it doesn't fit? There's something that was actually very similar. So what I'm gonna have to do is go to another hardware because it was so close, it's just too short and the other ones are too thick. So I'm gonna check out the other hardwares before I, I buy something at the first location and you never know, I might, might find something nice, is it? So, how about so? Yeah, go find some, you know, I think I'm just gonna make this a whole vlog. A little one day yeah. vlog. That's all the park. I'll see you. <laughs> Alright guys. <laughs> Yo, I'm a lot of people, you know. Alright. Go and get some KFC. The lead two-piece here is so cute. The two-piece set man is real cute. Anywho, um Chad called me. I was trying to find some I was trying to find some um, cook shop, like something more healthy. 
um, not that all home cooked meals or cook shop meals are healthy, but some more, you know, homey. <laughs> um, couldn't really find one. I was gonna go to this other place, but then Chad called and said, um, if I can buy the KFC and he'll give me my money back. Yeah, so I'm gonna do that. I'm thinking to dye my hair back black. You can't see it now, but like, just imagine me. Just with, not black, cause my hair isn't even black. My hair is like a dark brown. But I'm thinking to dye it back to its natural color. I'm kind of over the like, blonde ends. Look on this nasty police car. Like, sometimes when you just turn on the lights for absolutely nothing, don't you just hate that? And then more time you see them, them stop up the road and gone inside and want like a shop or something. What you know? Hurry up, man. Cause them people cause accident too, you know? Like if it was important and this is like what I'm learning from like some service people that when it's actually really, really important, like then the road need to clear, you'll hear the sirens. You'll hear the sirens. I can rumble so easily. I don't know what's wrong with me. My mind is like a goldfish, just switch subjects so quickly. But no, I forgot about the sign up. I like Spanish Town. I feel like Spanish Town needs so much like investments, but the crime and the bad mindness of people is what keep and I just don't understand like I love when people are proud of their community, proud of them come from so I'm telling you, him just come stop right here, so I never know where important him go. I just come stop right here, so I'm telling, I'm telling you, I'm gonna see it. Anyways, um, I don't want to block the way. Move, you in the way. Remember when Rihanna said that? Move, you in the way. <laughs> so I'm telling you, my mind is like a fish. I literally, listen, y'all taxis are killing me go car I'm gonna come down here one day with a, like ten thousand dollars and buy not even lock my door and buy some stuff some clothes some hot girl clothes but like you know Spanish town um, downtown them thing there I think that would be such a cool video I keep saying it but I never do it uh, Peter Gay did a video like that like a haul of stuff she had bought downtown and it was cool it's cool it's a nice thing like for people who not easily have it for go shop online lord watch dirty water this is not sanitary man the drainage system must block up because watch the big hole and the water not going anywhere i really i really i want to run for office just not in town i'd more so run for office in the country but when we see these things, I'm like, we can't be okay with these things, man. We cannot be okay with these. Anyways, let me continue. Oopsies. There's a talking vlog in it. Let me show on the wall going outside. We just love to see the, um, the way people hustle. And Jamaicans are definitely hustlers. I love it. I love to see it. Young black men, young black women doing their thing. Older black men, older black women. I love to see it. What I'm going to know is find a little spot and park. Bashko is really nice. We are the brother. Sure. I'm not doing that. Y'all just saw that, right? The same place with the bus man. Well, the girl never that pay attention to what she does or either. But the same place where the bus man lit down the girl. Right there. These coaster bus drivers, I know a couple of them. And I can't speak to how they drive, but in general, these um, coaster bus drivers, they drive scary. They drive like them on the road. And that there was this major accident on Spanish Town Road that I was telling you guys about in a previous vlog. 
and it was the bus driver was at fault people who were there were commenting on it and saying it was the bus driver who was at fault like when I really like this man may I wait for the taxi just come out and him just shove out like that like y'all don't understand that y'all have people's lives in your hands anyway so some of the clothes that I'm gonna tell you about could I buy some hot girl clothes this outfit's been here for like the past seven months one thing though about them, them price things so expensive. I'm like, ma'am, ma'am, don't let me tell you about this Alibaba outfit, please. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes I'm affordable. Don't own, but don't want to get expensive. So Shauna even said, don't want to get very, very, very expensive. But these outfits are cute. But bridal party. I wouldn't mind um, pulling over now and just come finding out what some of them outfits here were. But you see, the thing is, I'm gonna dress. Oh my god, that two piece, that white outfit is so cute. I'm gonna dress how I can't dress, I can't go like how I normally dress. Um, I would have to. Why is this taxi? Where, where do you want us to go? Look in front of me, like, why are you beeping? Anyways, but I have to wear like tights and like a black t-shirt. I want busted up shoes. I want like a bag because them can't think say you have a leap of money or they're just gonna upcharge you and we're not here for that. So yeah. <laughs> that, that's my tip for when you go shopping. Um like roadside shopping in Jamaica. Don't dress uptownish. Uptownish don't dress don't dress up in general and these are what advice that other people has given me worse because I, guys I'm just a ramble at this point let me get back to you when I get back to Chad's house so I am at Ari Jerk right now and they do like fried chicken and they do cook food they cook food pork, stew pork, jerk pork Spicy chicken, jerk chicken, um, white rice, mashed potato, rice and peas, everything like every single thing that you can imagine, pasta, all of them. So and fish if you're um, if you're pescatarian and they have salad. So a nice man, a nice. Um, I'm just gonna buy food for Chad and his grandma. Drop it off and then Ashley just invited me to a Smirnoff event which is going on right now so I said yes of course I'm doing a daily vlog and I think that will make the vlog even more fun so that's really nice of her um, it is last minute so I'm gonna have to hurry up because it's starting soon but to chop it to my house and then chop it to Kingston because I'm actually excited I wish I got invited earlier like maybe even this morning then I would have been more prepared um I'm trying to think of my outfit in my head and it's just not coming to me I have a video I have a video to edit for tomorrow oh my god I am not prepared I will be editing it editing it to night though so it will definitely go up tomorrow weekly vlog will go up tomorrow but um, I have my outfit idea just kind of festering up there. It just needs to come. I know what heels I'm gonna wear. My classic go-to heels now. Um, I just feel like maybe I'll just grab a simple little dress. But I'm trying to get home, but there's traffic. But anyways, I'm gonna chop it home. Like I said, chop it to the event, and then I'll just see you when I get to the event for. The reason being that I don't want this vlog to be all over the place and really long, so I'm gonna stop talking. Well, you, you weren't seeing my face, sorry.
I can't really talk for long, but make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what your favorite drink is. Tonight we're here with Smirnoff, so let me know. Don't be shy in the comments. Like, it's, let's get lit. It's happy hour time, and I hope you enjoy the vlog. But like so I said, the are killing me. I feel like my, my pussy is like the feet. Woo! <laughs> you know what the night out is. You know what the Kingston. Why am I so zoomed in? Hold on, guys. Was I all zoomed in? Was I zoomed in? Where are we heading now? Jangas, I think. Jangas, we think, yeah. Where we going? We're trying to see what the vibe is. It's been a while since I've really been out like this. Jangas or, or deck. Probably. Our deck. Um, or if you want, we can make a stop by AC. What is up to the night? location now called the pub never heard of it before but Ashley's taking us here so that's really really cool there's a sign so yeah well, we're ending off the night at this location because after this we've got to go home oh Ashley all right guys update definitely lied to you because I'm seeing the back and I've been here before been here years ago but I've definitely been here before so